Welcome. In today's video, I'll be talking about the Technical Analysis Pro Excel template. Specifically, what is the purpose of this template? What are the benefits of using this template? Answers to frequently asked questions about this template. And finally, how you can get this template. Now let's get started. What is it? A simple and effective tool to do technical chart analysis on stocks in an Excel spreadsheet. Who can use it? Anyone doing stock trading or forex trading and want to use technical analysis to make sound and smart trading decisions can benefit from this template. Technical indicators are nothing but calculations that are performed on the price and the volume data of a specific stock in order to determine your trading decision, whether you want to sell or buy. Now, what technical indicators are included in this template? There are 25 technical indicators included, right from the moving averages, crossovers, we have Bollinger Bands, MACD, RSI, or Relative Strength Index, and a lot more. So all those 25 indicators are available to you automatically pre-built in this single Excel file. So now I have the template open. The input is very, very simple. All we have to do is to type in a specific stock symbol. So here we have entered already for Tesla, but let's do another one. So let's say Microsoft. It is in the NASDAQ stock exchange. So I'm typing in X N A S. So it's the NASDAQ stock exchange colon MSFT is the ticker symbol for Microsoft. So I'm going to hit enter. And now it is going to go and pull the data, the live real time data from Microsoft service. And there we go. So now we know the price, we have the technical indicators, we also have all the charts updated. So it takes typically two to three seconds. Uh, it took a little bit longer here because I'm also recording. Uh, and so it, my computer is a little bit slower than usual. But otherwise, typically two to three seconds maximum is how long it takes to refresh all that data for a new stock symbol. So let's do one more example. So I'm going to put in X and Y S for New York Stock Exchange, colon, I'm going to type F for Ford Motor Company, hit enter. So now it's going to go ahead and pull all that data for this specific stock, which is the Ford Motor Company. And you will see that the time, the last traded time is represented here, and it is near real time data um, that is being pulled from the market, and the market is actually open right now. And this is how you can input any stock symbol and then pull back the technical information about that specific stock. Now let's look at what the output uh, pieces are. And so you have the 25 technical indicator values that are automatically calculated for the specific stock and displayed here. And you will also see the previous day just so that you can see how it has changed. And we also provide the previous day information. And we also have the signal. The signals are um, as of 28 March, which is the latest information right now we are looking at what is the signal trading action or trading signal recommended buy or sell and this these are based on specific conditions um, using a specific strategy to determine buy or sell all of these things are documented in our support portal where you can see the specific conditions that have been applied to arrive at the buy or sell signal and then we have five different charts that you can actually automatically generate in this template. The first is the candlesticks, which is straightforward. It's a regular candlestick chart. So then you have the, um, what I'm calling it as the signal chart, which is, it will show you the buy and sell signals based on a specific, um, let's say for example, I'm gonna choose this indicator. Depending on the indicator you choose, you will see a buy and a sell signal. So for example, 25th March, there was a sell signal generated for the stock um, using the uh, simple moving average indicator. There was a buy signal generated on the 16th of March using the simple moving average indicator. So again, depending on which indicator you want to use, these signals will obviously be different, but you can choose the indicator of your choice and this chart will update to show you the signals. And also, as we scroll to the right, we have more charts. 
So this one, I'm calling it as the multiple indicator chart because you can actually plot two different indicators at the same time in a single chart. So here I can see that there is a, I've already chosen Bollinger Bands and I've, I've chosen EMAC, which is the EMA crossover indicator. And instead of EMA crossover, I can change it to SMAC or simple moving average crossover and it'll update accordingly to that. Or I can do just a super trend indicator and now it will plot the super trend indicator in a dotted blue line. So this is how you can choose any of those indicators in the drop down, which can be plotted along with the price axis. So for example, if I want to see the actual closing price as a line on the same chart, all I have to do is to do this. And now I have a black line indicating the actual price. So now let's move on to the next couple of charts, which are stacked on top of each other, as you can see. And we have two different indicators and you can choose again from the drop down of 25 indicators. And this is RSI that is chosen. And if I wanted to choose Williams uh, indicator, and now you can see that it changed. And on, in the bottom, you have the MACD indicator. And again, you can change this to some other indicator of your choice. Uh, I can do uh, Donchin channels and now it is going to go and update to the Donchin channels. So this is how you can uh, have up to five different indicators across all these charts being visible to you uh, in addition to the candlestick, in addition to the table of uh, technical indicators and signals and so on. So all of this is automatically generated, fully interactive uh, in this template. So now let's move on to answers to some of the frequently asked questions about this template. So now the first question would be, how can I customize or can I customize the parameters for the technical indicators? The answer is yes. So if you go to the setting sheet, you will have all the input parameters that you can control. And for example, if I don't want the simple moving average of nine periods, I can actually do 20 periods by just typing in 20. So this is how you can see all those technical indicators. You have all these parameters which are shown in blue available for you to control and modify according to your preferences. The next question would be, can I look at any time or any his, uh, point in history for the data? And you can see here that even though the data is shown to be the latest, I can actually show go back to custom and I can type in a date. So for example, I want to look at what was the specific indicator values on November 11th. Uh, I can just type it in and now you will see that the November 11th indicator values are shown here and the charts will now go until the 11th of November. This is helpful if you're trying to look back in time at a specific point, what are all the indicator values. Um, on, I'm going to switch this back to latest, which will automatically give us the 28th of March, which is today data. And now I can also change to look at the chart uh, instead of one month. Um, I can look at it three months of history and you will now see that the charts have changed to three months. Uh, let me put it back to one month or actually let me put it to six months. And you'll see a lot of points now, uh, but I can change this to a weekly time frame instead of daily. Um, rem one thing to remember is that when we change the time frames, it, it will go and pull back the data from the market uh, and recalculate everything because the time frame is a new input and it'll go and grab. So now you have. Um, you can see on the charts that it's weekly data. So 20th of September, 27th of September, and so on. So each week is a different point now on the, all the charts. So this is how you can customize the time frame that you are using for the charts. Can you rearrange the charts or you know do it in different sizes? Yes, the answer is yes. You can click on any chart and make it larger or smaller according to your needs. You can also move them around. And if I don't want this to be here, I can move this around and I can move another chart over here. So it is very, very flexible. Just like any Excel file that you are used to using, you can make those changes. So for example, if I wanted to edit the chart, you can right click and edit the chart just like any Excel chart.
can I make any formatting changes, colors and fonts? Yes, you can. You can just do use the Excel's default formatting changes um, because there's no restriction. You can modify however you would like in a, any regular Excel spreadsheet. Can we add more sheets to this? So you can add more sheets by just clicking on new sheet and then uh, you know entering your own calculations, whatever you want to do, all in the same Excel file. You can only look at one stock symbol at a time. You cannot look at multiple uh, stock symbols to pull technical indicators for multiple. You can only do one for one stock symbol. However, if you want to do some of your own calculations, um, then the Excel file is not restricted. So you can add more sheets and uh, extend it according to your needs. So will I have full access to the file complete? So will you have complete access to the file? Yes. So when you purchase this template, you will receive a password which you can use to edit the file according to your needs. Um, the password is not needed for you to use the file just like I'm doing a demo. Um, I don't need a password to do any of this. However, if you want to modify something, if you want to change the way something is calculated, um, you can go ahead as long as you're very familiar with Excel and feel comfortable doing so, you can and we will be giving the password to the file along with your purchase. How does the template get the market data? Microsoft introduced stocks data type and Microsoft provides this as part of their Microsoft 365 subscription, the stock market history data. So that is where all this data is coming from. And from my experience, the data is near real time. It could be a few minutes delayed sometimes, but mostly I've seen a lot of improvement uh, lately and it is near real time information from the stock market. What stocks are included? Um, this is kind of beyond my control. And um, from what I've experienced, most of the stocks are included in the service. However, I've come across a few that are not there. And um, again, Microsoft, it's completely up to Microsoft service. And uh, I'm sure that they are expanding it and including as many um, stock symbols as possible across as many stock exchanges across the world as possible. I would recommend checking out our free stock lookup Excel template because you can then test and see if your favorite stocks are actually there. And that template is absolutely free and I'll provide a link in the video description for that. So ju just download that, put in your favorite stocks and see if the service re returns back the results. If it does, that means that your favorite stocks are included in the service and you can go ahead and get this template to do more technical analysis. What do you need in order to make this template useful? So you would need the Microsoft 365 subscription uh, and Microsoft 365 subscription um, is includes all those popular applications like Excel, Word, PowerPoint, Teams, um, OneDrive with one terabyte of cloud storage, Outlook and many more. And so you don't have to pay anything more just for the stock history data. If you already have one of those Microsoft 365 subscriptions, then you don't need to pay anything more. If you do not have a Microsoft 365 subscription, then you would have to get one of those. And I will provide a link to the Microsoft's product page for you to get more information about the Microsoft 365 plan. So how do you get this template? So you can download this template by purchasing from ainzara.com. I will provide a link to the specific download page in the video description. And as soon as you make the order or the purchase, immediately you will have access to this file. There's no waiting time. Just make the purchase, immediately download the file and start benefiting. What if there are any upgrades or changes to the file? we will email the new updated file to your email address which you provided when you purchased the template and this will be absolutely free all the upgrades and all the updates have always been free to existing customers of inzara do you have any documentation on how to use this template and frequently asked questions yes so we have a separate support portal which has the step-by-step -step user guide and other information related to this template all in one place and you will be able to find that link and as soon as you purchase you'll be sent that information as well what if 
you need another indicator apart from these 25 technical indicators you have your own uh, preference of an indicator which is not there what do you need to do uh, or what do you need to do if you have any specific modifications that you're interested uh, and you need some assistance we do take customization projects for a fee so please email us your requirements to support at inzara.com and provide your detailed requirements we will review them and provide you an estimated cost of development and we'll be happy to assist you as needed if there are any other questions that i've not answered please put them in the comment section below and i'll be happy to respond as soon as i can thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you soon in another video